Ladale Richie comes into the starting line of four Mount Pleasant. And these are how the, this is how the host will set up. It will be a 4-3-3 formation. John Wilson between the sticks because Kemar Foster on national duty. Dallas Kamani Stewart comes in. Elvis Wilson, Keithy Simpson, the experienced centre back. Denardo Thomas, the player, play, the, the wide player full of flair. Denardo Navardo Blair, Christopher Matthews, Shemar Booth, Javain Bryan, the joint leading goal scorer in the league, and Rivaldo Mitchell, who is well in a real purple patch so far. Four goals on the season for him. Their head coach Marcel Gale. You expect this Waterhouse team to really come to the party today. TV game behind their home support. They'll make it very difficult for this Mount Pleasant unit. Mount Pleasant with many changes and the changes in the formation as well. 4-5-1 Tafari Chambers between the sticks because there's no Shaquan Davis. Ladale Ritchie, their ever experienced man. Centre back will take the captain's armband. Malachi Sterling, one of the best players in, in schoolboy football this season will play the left back role Melvin Dox is in St. Lucian, Shaquille Dyer regular man in the, in the heart of it Kimoni Bailey has had an impressive season the dreadlock, the wide player Shaquille Bradford, 10 goals so far in the season, although 8 of them for Harborview, Gawain Austin, Tevin Shaw Shandy James and Daniel Green complete the starting lineup. Green has been in goal, goal, goal scoring form their head coach Theodore Whitmore Yeah, over 7 players well 7 players A tough fixture, Nerissa Golson, the lady in charge of it. And Daniel Green early, full match highlights, of course, this was the first half. And Daniel Green letting fly, it was a good save, low down from, jo from John Wilson to deny. And then that one off the upright from Daniel Green. He had a pretty good game, Daniel Green, the Mount Pleasant number nine. This allows a touch from Melvin Doxley and Shafane Bryan. Letting fly from distance but couldn't hit the target as they exchanged punches in that first half. Now into the second half, Denada Thomas showing his skill on the left hand side of the attack but couldn't get that on target. And then the corner. Thomas should have done better. Rose well, Denada Thomas. Good connection but didn't hit the target. And the Waterhouse number 10, his drought continues. He received more of the ball. This was put towards the back post and Brian was just a bit late. Maybe beaten for pace, Javain Bryan. Caught on the back foot as well. Daniel Green continued his, qual his quality. He hit the crossbar. Just going over. And then that strike, which was just wide, teed it up as well for Shande James, who couldn't keep his strike down. Malachi Sterling had a pretty good game coming into the starting lineup. Two bites of the chair for Kimoni Boyle. On that occasion, but much to dismay of his fans, he put it over until this moment. He had better in the locker, so much better. A magnificent strike. From Kimoni Bailey. Perfect technique. Just look at how he turned himself sideways. And the instep perfection for Mount Pleasant's number 12. 1-0 after 78 minutes. Mount Pleasant continued to pile on the pressure, Sterling to the back post, but one goal was enough for them to execute an important victory and take them back on top of the table. 1 0. 10 shots, 3 on target for them, just one shot on target for Motorhouse. They were disappointing going forward, just didn't create enough from the open play. There were four yellow cards in it, shown by Nerissa Golson. Two saves made by Wilson. Two impressive saves off the boot of Daniel Green as well. There was a save for Mount Pleasant in that. And they had nine corners in Mount Pleasant. Majority of the possession and the only goal in this one. Mount Pleasant with the Bob Marley. 1-0 over Waterhouse. Kimoni Bailey, today's man of the match. You certainly have an eye for a spectacular goal. Certainly you wouldn't have scored too many better than that one in your career. Well, um, for me still... I've scored better than that, but you know that that one that one was a, a good one also to add to the tally, you know. Yeah. And, and you started the season so well, you got the little injury and then now you're back into the team. I'm sure you're extremely happy to get that goal today. Yeah, definitely. And sometimes it's just the hard work and you know we just gotta be patient because I know it's coming. So it's just a patient for me. And this team is a winning team, it's a winning unit. 
what's the confidence level like to repeat as champions? Well, it's always a high confidence going into any game that we play because any team that come at us, they come with their A game, so we always have to go out there with our A game also. All right, spectacular goal today. Best of luck for the rest of the season. Okay, thank you. That was Kimoni Bailey, one of the best.